thank you so much for joining me as Gimmage. We're jumping into Bermuda Lost Survival again, and it's time for us to build a raft today. I did spend some time going down and getting a whole bunch of loot, and we're pretty much full. I have to make two more crates right here for us to start storing away stuff. But today, we need a couple of things. All right, I'm going to go through this with you guys. There's, there's a couple of things I saw in here before we left uh, last episode, and I want to go and get it done. If you roll down here, there's improvised bag. That's going to be helpful for us. I believe, and also that scuba tank would be really nice. Now we need five iron. I, luckily enough, I did find one more of those fine cannons down below, and I think we can utilize that. Now we have seven left of these. Let's go back in here. I didn't check to see exact. We need five, and that one I need, uh, sorry, it's, I need plastics. Total plastics need here, okay, and I need a total of five iron, which I have. So let's do that. Let's get the five iron on us here. We'll split this up here and take it to five. So five, right here, perfect, thank you. And then we're also gonna go grab ourselves some Plasticos, which I've been working on, by the way, grabbing some more loot and stuff, so we should have a little bit, of, well, more than enough for us to kind of up to our game. We're also gonna need rope for this. Oh, I wonder if I have enough rope. I have more than enough rope. <laughs> Got so much friggin' rope. All right, so that's great. Well, guys, we'll upgrade our stuff that we need right here. So improvised bag currently, let's just double check to see how much room we can carry. At uh, 210, all right? So I just want to make sure we, we have, uh, you know, we know exactly how much more we get from this. So we got improvised bag curly, and we're going to get the scuba tank, which obviously we know what that's going to do, right? It's going to kick us up a notch. Boom! Scuba tank! And then we can also uh, spend a little bit on here if we want to. I don't know if we have enough iron. Uh, I don't believe we do. Actually, we do have enough iron for that. Uh, we can kick it up if we want to. That's really up to us. Now let's check out the bag. 230 20 more slots for the improvised bag It's too bad we can't do more than that what is 230 whatever it is wait they're, they're going with uh we have uh need iron for our, our little knife for here to move it up to and that wouldn't be such a bad idea to have uh, since we're going in pretty deep in some stuff there's an iron bottle it's gonna fill up a lot faster but i think i'm better off investing in this as we go through it uh, i'm gonna grab that I think is our best bet. Also want to make sure I don't need it for anything else here. Anvil needs 10 iron. Yeah, that's something we're going to go and get right away. I didn't have enough anyways for that. I did check that. So yeah, let's just make that happen today. Let's just go and get ourselves a better knife. We need two sticks. I wonder if I have sticks. Yeah, so I have more than enough of that too. We're good. Look at that. Jeez. Talk about freaking un like everything unlocked pretty darn quick in this game. Holy moly. All right. Well, that's great. Let's put this stuff away. And start looking to craft up our fine little raft that we're going to build. Yeah, that's right. There's a raft in this game, and that's what we're building here. We have to build a dock, so we're going to craft that sucker up. Don't worry about our base, too. We can come back and build it up. We can build five docks. That's pretty impressive. Now, you're probably saying to yourself, there's not much loot in here. There is tons of it. You just don't see it. There's more in here over there and there's more in here of rope and stuff and there's more there and there's more in there so yeah we have more than enough for us to do our stuff let's check out our fine little knife we have now Ooh, got a little hook on it <laughs> that's too much we do we craft that or do we find that maybe we found it on the raft over there it's possible all right let's grab this and find where we're going to place this sucker up here so yeah right against here it looks good to me and yes bang awesome busy days yeah the iron bottle i'd like to get to but we're not going to get that right away i want to go back to my little knife i like it it's a pretty darn sexy knife one all right let's go open up this and uh, for this we're gonna need 20 rope 10 sticks and 15 planks 20 rope let's uh, split this to 20 Again, we have to worry about our weight, but we should be okay. I'm just going to grab a stack of everything here. So we don't have to split it up. We can carry this weight. It's all good. All right. So, yeah, we can craft up our ceiling raft right there. And unlock that baby, right? What is it? I have to put it inside here? It's storing. <laughs> we got to store some stuff in here. I forgot completely to do that. That's right. There we go. Now we can unlock this baby. All right. Nice. There's also these things right here. Quick travel. That are going to open up. All right, that's interesting. I, I don't know what to do with those actually right now. Quick travels. I think that's after once we discover these three different locations, we can actually click on this and it'll bring us there right away with a raft. So I don't go about sailing back and forth. That is pretty cool. I'm liking that quite a bit. All right, there we go. Our fine raft, our fine little knifey. 
I think it looks pretty cool, that raft, actually. I like the way it looks. It looks pretty good. Yep, I'm, I'm, I'm into it. All right, so we can get that rolling today and probably head out and about and do some work. The only thing I'm scared about is I have no bandages. I really don't have very much, but I'm going to go grab the ones we have here. And by the way, if you're wondering where the tarp went for this, that's what we used it for for the actual bandit, for the uh, the raft itself. So the tarp that was on top of this ends up being used for that, which makes sense. All right, we also need water. I'm pretty sure I have tons here. And yeah, more than enough in here too, and too much salt, as you can see. By the way, the fish did dry up nicely in here when I put them on here. They did come in dry like that. So you got extra fish. So I'm going to put a little bit of food and resources on this raft just in case. And we can drop that off of here like so. Maybe a little rum bottle. Maybe that's too much, though, actually. You know what? I'm going to have to put some back here. That's I need to bring back some stuff with me here. All right. And I think that's maybe too much. So I'm going to grab the fine stuff since we already have some regular food those new little cans what i'm gonna end up doing is i'm gonna well first of all fill up my water here just in case and we're gonna grab ourselves i have the badges i have that i think i'm just gonna put these back here they might go bad i know but at this point i think they become this here you guys were mentioning into soil uh, which i think we need, need anyways for our garden so good stuff all right here's the map if you guys are wondering there's a bounty reef uh, right here. That's where we're at right now. There's Sandy uh, Crater and there's the Sunken Ashes. I think we'll head out to this place here. So if you click on a map, I should be able to find it once I take up this. Boom. Yep. Nice and easy. All right. Uh, Dad, I feel like I'm maybe carrying too much stuff. There's maybe too much water to use. <laughs> Dude, that's, I mean, every little bit counts, right? I don't want to be able to be too heavy. Now, if you make this too heavy, the raft will flip over. I'm telling you right now, it's happened to me. I'll fix that up afterwards. It's not organized. It will flip over. You can sleep here too and you can save. So it makes it nice. Uh, there's also buoys and stuff we can craft up. And I believe we can craft this on here too. Is that possible? Yeah, we can. So we should probably craft up a couple of buoys for us to go back and forth. Uh, two sticks, three... Uh, two planks, three sticks, three ropes. You know what? I think I can craft them over there. Let's just go and do this here. I remember seeing them here too. We'll make ourselves a couple of buoys so we can utilize them. There they are. We'll go five buoys. Five buoy buoy. Whoa, whoa. Taking those with us. And then we're going to head out in about that direction. And I believe, where is it? Right there. That's our waypoint to find. So we're going to the first place today. And uh, hopefully getting some good stuff. I'm not sure. I don't remember which one it was that had all the, uh, the loot in it for the iron and stuff. Not sure if not both of them. I know that there's some uh, stuff there that's kind of scary on some of it. That's just really nice. All right, I think that's pretty good. That's more enough that I need. All right, how are we doing on food and stuff for us personally before we leave? All right, we could take a, a little snack, I think. There we go. Oh, yeah, it's true. That's the reason why. I just went, I can't eat. I can eat. I just have to put this in quick access at number two because we took out the other fish. All right, no food poisoning. Yay! All right. Seems like it was food poisoning one after another lately. Uh, eh. You know what? I'll carry it with me. All right. Let's do this. We're going to sail in away. It's pretty easy. It's WASD. Then you go around and you just kind of bring yourself straight forward facing your raft. And bam. So the quick. Now the, the way for us to go quick back there. That is really cool. I don't think we can do it from here. But if we want to go back out to this reef, that makes a big, big difference for us to go and do some quick travel. Because it can take some time. It really can. If you look at the map right there, you'll see my little raft. It's actually moving itself. And you can actually sail the direction you want to. You can actually see it moving. So we're approaching the actual area that we need to go into. And yeah, can you believe it or not, there you go. Reef discovered. Sandy Crater. We have arrived. Uh, we can park our little raft maybe close to the middle. I'm just looking at the gr the down there. I'm seeing where the middle part is there. I think I'll just park it right here. And we don't have to put an anchor or anything. Thankfully, we do just leave it there and it, it won't move. <laughs> it's a great raft, I tell you. All right. Just get off this. Perfect. And we've arrived where we want to, so we can take rid of that. And get a nice knife. Beauty. Beauty. All right. We'll keep these in here for now. I was actually right. I'm not going to want to carry those with me. I'll put the food and water in here and uh badges and stuff i'll keep one a heavy duty bandage on us like that and we're gonna go down below hopefully we can find some good loot let's wish us luck yes Woo. 
Yes, our new scuba gear too, right? That is pretty cool. I'd say the raft looks really nice. Clean wood and all. All right, here we go. Sandy Reef. It looks a little different from last time we went down here. Yeah, there's missing some stuff here, I think. The scuba gear is crazy. Oh, my God, look at this. Big sub down here. All right, we should probably start looking around for some goodies. Can I not, uh, no, I can go right through that. And there's the doors. I don't want to root it for you guys, but uh, there's something missing in this. Last time I went here, it was something a little different than I thought. All right, I'm not sure if it's because I was supposed to go with the other one first or not, but we'll take advantage of this place being empty. And I think we might have to go to the other one to go and get the iron and stuff, because there's no iron in this area. I need the iron to get moving. And getting ahead. I'm not actually sure how long this scuba gear lasts. It seems to last for freaking ever. Holy crap, it's awesome. Always wonder with some games. Yeah, there's no. We'll come back here and do a full investigation. There is none that I'm looking for right now. I need the iron. So this is not where we want to go. We want to go right there. Look at Triangle. <laughs> what the frick? It's awesome. All right, so we've reached a location here, is sunken. And we're going to go back a little further into it. I'm just going to get a little bit more so we can go in there and find the loot that we need. This might take a couple of shots because we only fit a certain, certain amount of weight on us and plus on there. So that's going to be the tough part. All right, this is pretty good. We'll start off right here in this location and we'll jump off of it and check out the seat. Uh, how am I doing on food and stuff? I should check that out. A little bit of a ceiling trip. Oh, we're good. We're good. Don't need a compass anymore. Oh, it's dark, isn't it? It's bloody dark all right there's some sulfur right there there's the iron we're looking for that's the stuff gonna harvest this baby up again we gotta watch out for our weight we really do and there's some sulfur right here and we gotta be careful that remember correctly is bloody hot in game too not just a graphic i don't want to cook myself up not sure if I can get to that close without cooking up a bit. Oh, we can. That's surprising. All right. I've actually gone in there and I almost died, right? So I remember that correctly. Oh, man, this scuba gear is like OP. Very nice. Can I go over this without burning up? All right. Well, maybe not. Maybe you don't have to worry about the heat. I'm not gonna go all the way in there and find out, but I'm gonna I'm gonna play as if it is hot stuff, you know, lava and all. Oh, this is so much better with that freaking scuba gear, dudes. It do this. There's some more sulfur down there. Oh man, imagine the heat in this. It just melt up everything around you. The water would just boil you alive. Oh, it's bright light. Oh, it's pushing me up. It's pushing me up. That's awesome. <laughs> okay, I can't really reach that one too well. All right, well, this place has pretty much not much there either. There is a crate right here. There's not really a loot I'm looking for, but I don't know. Maybe they're hiding some stuff in there too. There is some scrap. I don't really care about the boards. We have more enough. I'm just going to grab these in case there's extra treasure, including like anything we can find would be nice. Some of my bandages. Oh, another vase right here. I'm not sure what this does. Gotta be careful for those landmines. Oh yeah, just beeped, right? Halfway. Wow. It's a big ass sulfur. Grab it all. We're gonna need some stuff. Rather we have it now. But we can always come back and forth on this. And I think it regens itself, if I'm not mistaken, after a day. And such, you gotta go and sleep it off. Super bright light. Here, I'm worried about it being dark. I gotta fight the current here. Oh, the heat just kind of pushing me back up. Looks this without me doing anything. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay, I'm gonna go get some air. 
I'll go do a quick drop off at the same time. We'll do this quick, and we'll go investigate. It's nice we found that vase, though. I'm not sure if there's a couple needed, and then it opens up something. I don't know. I know there's a secret to that, but just don't know what they're going to make us do with this. All right, I'm going, I'm going. Super deep dive. That's why we made this. By the way, if we had this snorkel, it would be... If we can get down there, we'd have to come back up. It wouldn't be very long before we had to get our butts back up. So let's see here. We got a shite load of sulfur. Very nice. We got that super vase right here. Still no idea what it does. And, of course, some planks and some stuff. I should check before I do anything. Is this rocks? Come here for a second. I want to grab this. I'm not going to bring rocks me, dudes and dudes. I'm going to tell you now. I'm not bringing rocks. All right. Stone, yeah. We're just going to drop that. And this is collectible items. No effect yet. I don't know what it is. Okay, I'll drop the stone inside. Okay, I'll just collect it and I'll drop it. All right, back in. And we can drop these things off. If it's too heavy and I don't want to carry this, drop sack. Buy stack. See you later. Drop the sack. All right, we got to find a nice big resource. I know they have some. Unless I change it up. There's a beautiful sail, but right here. Anything we can take apart here? Oh, geez, the light's bright. How about this? It looks like something we can take apart, but no. Can you grab the rope? Nothing. Huh. There is plastic, though. Those are they are quite useful. So if we find them, we're gonna grab them. We're gonna leave the rocks behind. Oh, there's some more iron. I see it. Let's go and grab it. Oh, there's a whole bunch on that side. We really need this stuff. Boy, it fills up the backpack fast. I just saw it go up really quick. I went, ooh. It's not horrible, but it's definitely quite a bit. Can I destroy these? No. Nothing hidden inside there, right? No treasures underneath. Gotta make sure there's nothing else that's in here. No, nothing else. All right, let's go back and get the rest of this iron. We are at least exploring a little bit of this place. I think sulfur, we're pretty good for right now. I guess we can take if we need it, because it's not going to take it. Now, people ask me all the time about this here. I'm going to explain to you, in case you haven't seen the first episodes. You should go back and check it out, though. Uh, we need to make some of that explosives, and we need actually this stuff to do it. So that's the reason why we're carrying that. We're we'll able to make ourselves some, uh, some explosives and open up those containers. Definitely the goal. Oh, I see something in there. There's a treasure. I saw a treasure. Let's go before I forget. Another vase. Huh. Okay. Nothing in there. Come back and blow those up if we can. Let's see what's inside. Probably should grab all the stuff he can there. You know what? Let's go back up really quick and get ourselves a little bit of air. This way, no problemos for a good long dive and picking up our stuff. And our raft is right there, so we're good. Go, go, gadget, go! You could do it, buddy. Push yourself. Oh, there's something right here, too. Nice. I'm not sure which. I think the sulfur takes quite a bit to make what we want to make. So it's probably a good idea to grab it. Now, I don't remember correctly. It, it took a lot of sulfur, if I, know, if I remember correctly, to make what we want to make. So, you know what? Screw it. Let's just grab it. Can't hurt to have. I'd rather have more than not enough. And I need to come back every two seconds to go and grab this stuff. Is there any more uh, iron around here? No. 
There's definitely some sulfur down there. We can maybe grab the last little bit underneath that shipwreck here. And maybe check to see if we can go into that shipwreck from this angle. No, nothing else in there. All right, we're going to sail in just a little bit more into this reef onto the other side of it, the north side, and see if we can't uh, find anything else over there. I'm going to put it right uh, as close to the middle as possible so we can dive down. I know it's that direction because we're, uh, I think it's that direction, hopefully. All right, let's just turn this baby here. And that's good for me. Good stuff. All right, let's switch over from this. Uh, do I need food? I did feed myself before sleep. Let's just grab a little more. That's my last, by the way, my fish. I got lots of water left, but uh, we also have some canned fish here, so we're okay. The more the merrier. I made those buoys and I still haven't used them. All right, it's going to be a little bit dark. I apologize in advance. There's no lights or anything. Sharks are here. I'm not going to sit here and start cooking or anything. I'm here to really get loot as much as we possibly can. And there is some nice little... I think it's terracotta, right? I believe. Yeah, terracotta. Don't want any of those. Don't really care for those. We will need the terracotta, though, so take it if you can. Same thing for plastics. Those are two valuable things. The rest of that stuff, like the boards and planks, if I need room, I'll just drop those. The hell's that? There's more containers and something on there. Oh, it's so tough to tell. It's dark as frig right now. Probably should have slept for an extra hour. Oh, man. I hope daylight shows up quick. There's something on top of this ridge here. Let's go and check it out. More containers. Oh, another vase. How many of these we need to collect? Gotta figure out how many of those vases we have to look around for. At least they do sparkle, so we'll keep our eyes out for that. But exploring definitely is a, a must. All right, there's some more stuff here. Whoa! Oh, okay, didn't realize they were there. Okay, we'll crack this. Grab that. I was hoping to find some extra stuff. We probably won't need any of that here. Let's go check to see if we can find any vases in these things, too, because I mean, if they're hiding everywhere, it's a possibility they're in here, too. Okay, you know what? Um, we're okay with food. Probably getting a little bit higher up for us to see if there's anything out here on this side of the reef. Now, I went to the outside of it, there was nothing there. Hoping to find a little more iron. It's not been too plentiful, but it's okay. Can't have it all in one shot. What's this? Some kind of little... There's more sulfur here. Crap, while, while we're here, might as well do it. I do want to come back and blow those things up anyways. Nothing hidden there. No. Just want to make sure. No iron around here either. I think we grabbed it all. Oh well. We'll just go and check out the outside of the reef here. Really quick. And double check it before we head back home. And then I have to start making some stuff here. Ooh, what's this? Don't think we investigated this part. Now maybe some of those vases are stuck inside this. But it wouldn't make sense to be in a shipping crate, right? It seems like something to be kind of thrown all over the place. They're ancient. They're not like supposed to be relics from here. Yeah, well, here we go. We got a rum bottle. That's good for our mental state if we ever need it. Willie's been helping out a lot though. And good sleep. Woohoo! We found some more. I love it. Was there more here too? Oh, I don't can't see. Damn, blinded by the light big time. Yeah, there's some more across from there. So I did find one more little area here. We can get some. I believe this down here has all been taken. Man, that ship is super on fire, man. Holy crap. It'd be burning forever and ever. Oh my god, you guys see that? That is so smart. This is why I look at these places in the middle. 
Oh. I can't do it. I can't get that iron. It's done. I can't. It's blinding me. We did get a vase. I don't know how many we needed these things. We did get a vase. I'm going to try to harvest it, but I don't think I can reach it. I have to really push down. Oh, no, it's done. Okay. Oh. That was nutty a bit. What's that? Oh, it's a bag I think I dropped. Yeah, I dropped the rocks. <laughs> It comes with a glow stick in case you need it, I guess. I believe when we leave the area, they dis it, uh, it despawns, but... That is wicked. Why do you look in the middle of these things? So that means there might be some on this wreck here. Okay, let's take one last look. We'll check that wreck out. We will come back and mine this area anyways. There might be some more stuff. Oh, I think there's another wreck over there. Holy crap, this place is big. Take a deep breath. We're going for the big wreck. Nothing. I don't see anything else hidden here. If it is, it's really well hidden. Yeah, it's all clear this part. I think I believe there's nothing left in these ones unless I'm I just missed it on the side, but we can't go in there. The rest of this shite is on fire, so I don't want to touch it either. Start getting stuck to that thing. My face mask. <laughs> Crap. Oh, I just touched it. It didn't burn me. That was by mistake. Or maybe morbid curiosity. I don't know. One of the two. All right, well, I guess we're good. I don't see anything else here that we can mine. Uh, it probably is a little bit of stuff, but I don't see it. We do have a couple of Plasticos we can grab. We're going to head back home, and then we we'll believe... Uh, whoa, I hear you. I hear you. Show yourself. Please let there be a whale one day or another. It would be appreciative so we can actually see it because it's been bothering me. Even like a killer willow comes in and takes care of the sharks one, you know, just gets angry and gets into a frenzy and starts racking out some sharks. And the sharks at least go away from the reef for a tiny bit. You know, that'd be cool because crap, I mean, I know they're scared shitless of those things. They definitely don't like them. They know the difference. All right, well, you know what? We're going to leave here for today and then we'll come back. Holy crap, you scared the shit of me, shark. And we're going to come back and, well, we're not going to come back here exactly. We're going to go back home and take care of what we need to do. We're also trying to see how many freaking fragments we need to survive. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything. Really, I think we gave it a good glance, though. I believe I went around here completely. Oh, I see. Yeah. Head back to the raft. Head back home. And next episode, I'll go and do a little bit of work on the raft, too. We'll probably, hopefully, make ourselves something. Then we'll have to go back to the other reef and do some investigations over there, too. And maybe there is iron over there. It's just not exactly where it's at prior. You know, like when we were jumping in. So maybe it's just a little different. Maybe there is a little bit of iron around, well hidden, and we'll have to check it out. So guys, if you guys want to see more of this, make sure you hit the like button, get in the comment fields. Always extremely appreciative. This game edge. No catch, guys. On the flip side.